Hi, I'm Random Trashy, welcome to the channel. So a recent game where I was damaged during a firefight, one of the lenses was actually shot clean out of my glasses. Quickly covered up, luckily one of my teammates noticed what happened and escorted me away from the field. When I left that day I felt that, you know, I was really worried that if someone had been on full auto, I'm very lucky that the guys on the site have very strict trigger control, um, but if they weren't on full auto that could have done some severe damage to my eyes, it really didn't give me much confidence in the eyewear protection that I was using. You know, that is just basic impact protective eyewear that you'd get from a BB manufacturer. Mine were actual guard the C1, so they've been very good up to that point, but I didn't have any faith in them after that. Uh, I did look around online, I wanted a full ballistic spec solution, so something that the military would be using. Uh, and there's a few companies out there that produce optics of that quality. One of them is Bowl uh, Safety. They do a full range of glasses called Bowl Tactical. So I hit up their Twitter, started having a bit of a conversation with them, explained to them what had happened, that I wanted to review some sort of tactical spec glasses um, and really give them a bit of a torture test. They said, look, we'll be happy to send you a sample, you know, give them a bit of a beating and then let us know how you get on. So they sent me out uh, a range of glasses here. So we've got the goggles from Bowl Tactical and we've got three sets of uh, glasses. Three very different sets of glasses as well, but today I'm going to be talking about the Fury. They're the ones I tested over the weekend. So these are the Fury glasses from Bol. Um, they're actually were well, R&D'd or researched and developed by uh, with a guy called Eric Gruffle. He is a French speed shooter and I think he's seven times world champion. Um, if you haven't seen speed shooting, it's definitely worth going to watch. Very, very exciting. Lots of very quick movement. Um, a lot of the time quite awkward position shooting through very small loopholes, taking down targets. Um, and it's about the overall time and the overall uh, accuracy that's done. So these were developed in line with him, you know, not to steam up, not to move around on his face at all, you know, to actually provide enough grip for the glasses to stay in place, even though in his, you know, laid down shooting prone or bent over, you know, crouching behind walls and all that sort of thing. I thought, you know, if they're going to be able to uh, stand that sort of a beating, then they'd be great for Milsim Airsoft, you know, where you're running between positions. Um, first off, when they sent me the kit from Bowl, very, very nice presentation, real nice boxes and that sort of thing. Everyone comes in a really, really nice, solid case. So, you know, this the box comes with, you know, some details around the glasses. I will go through that. Um, some nice promotional imagery um, and a very nice sturdy box as well. Sometimes, you know, you do get glasses that are a bit flimsy and you kind of feel a little bit disappointed. Uh, but, yeah, really nice big case. You can see here, really solid. Um, definitely not going to get damaged if you throw it in your kit box and that sort of thing. Uh, real nice quality as well. Real nice solid zip and everything on here as well. So it's going to be something that's going to last for a while. Just opening this up, I've got the glasses here and two sets of lenses at the bottom and I will go through them in a second. Instruction manual and in the bottom here you've got some anti-fog liquid which is really really nice little touch you know once you've used the glasses for a couple of months and you start wiping them off consistently they do begin to lose that film of anti-fog and you can just reapply that again uh, with the anti-fog solution that's in there and there's a manual to explain exactly how to do that in the back. Um, so I will go through the other lenses in a sec I'm just going to remove the glasses they come in real nice little um, you know little bag I guess and um, really, really good for cleaning the glasses if you need to. I like using natural glasses cleaning cloth um, rather than the bag because sometimes, you know, when it's, your hands are a bit dirty and that sort of thing and you're getting the glasses in and out of that, you know, they might be a little bit greasy. But just getting the glasses out, they are a little bit dirty from the weekend. They did get some abuse, but um, really, really nice. Very, very nice profile. Very, very nice bands that go down to the back of the head. Um, you've got two large lenses on the front here that wrap real around the head, and this is all one piece as well. So obviously I can't have that issue again of the lens being shot out because they are all one piece. Placing the glasses on very, very close to the brow. Um, and very, very, the way they've managed to make them fit the face, um, you know, I can't even get a fingertip in around here, so I've got no worries of a BB being able to get in behind the glasses and do any damage to my eyes. Again, really, really nice. Can't see the edges of the glasses at all, which gives you great peripheral vision. Um, my guard has, you know, had a frame around the outside, and sometimes you would lose kind of sight around here. Um, but definitely not going to happen with these. Very, very comfy to fit. Um, as I say, the bands go down, I wear an over-ear earpiece, and because the arms are so thin and very close to the head, that's not going to obstruct that at all, so they've obviously taken that into mind whilst designing these. Uh, it's very easy to change the glasses out. You literally just snap the arms out of the frame, just using these little clips at the top here, um, and then you just pull the nose piece off of two little pins that slides back and clips off the top of the frame um, and allows you to very, very quickly change those lenses out. So these are the standard clear ballistic spec uh, impact protective glass lens. Um, these are the clear ones. These are the ones that I was using when I was shooting over the weekend. 
very very nice they do have a slight coating on them which i think is uv protection um, i did notice that you get very little glare off of these even you know looking through these and then through into the scope itself um, you get very very little glare back um, very very comfortable to wear as i say great field of vision which is obviously very important you know when they were designed for having the peripheral vision for when eric is shooting his target so they've really taken into consideration some of the uh, real needs of someone that is going to be doing that type of shooting so these are really comfortable I'll leave these on uh, and go into the case i'm just going to get one of these other lenses out we'll start with the polarized lens really really nice quality um i think that's you know quite a key about all of the stuff and bowl has got a really nice kind of almost mirrored filter on there It'd probably be quite hard to see uh, they've got that slight yellow tinge to them so when you place them over your eyes you'll probably see these are a little bit darker but that yellow tinge really raises any ambient light um, and you can see that with quite a few shooting glasses uh, companies they do a very similar thing with their glasses just kind of raise that ambient light in low light scenarios they just kind of lift all the colors Lovely polarised uh, cover on it, you know, again, full impact protective, so all of these glasses you can wear, you know, during BBs, you can swap the lenses out depending on the environment and the situation that you're in, and these are all going to cope with being shot at and being abused. Um, you know, they have got anti-fog coating on every single lens, they've got anti-scratch uh, lens uh, coatings as well to stop them from being scratched. Uh, and I noticed over the weekend, you know, I dropped, I took them running with the black lenses in and actually dropped them uh, off the top of my head when I was taking them for a run. The good thing about this, it was a very, very warm day and I was running around the coastline. Nearly every glasses I've ever worn whilst out running have fogged and steamed up, whether they're standard sunglasses or, you know, actual running glasses, they've always, always steamed up because of the um, because of the environment. And these actually didn't the whole time I was running, which was really, really impressive. And I've never had that from other glasses before. So yeah, great lens these. You know, these would be perfect for, you know, low light situations or if you're going out on a dusk walk or, you know, if you're out on operations and it's early morning, then these are going to be a great choice of lens for you. Moving over to the dark lenses. So these are almost like the sunglass type lenses. I must say the UV protection from these is phenomenal. They're very, very dark when they're on. So as you can see, they're almost completely black. Um, I've got a pair of Oakleys and I've got a pair of Ray-Bans as well that I just wear casually and the UV protection from these absolutely blows them away. When I was out with my run I actually had these lenses in um, and you could see the mirrored reflection of the sun on the sea and there was no you know, kind of squinting or hesitation from the eyes just to be able to focus in all of the areas around there. So if you was out in the desert or if you was out in a snowy landscape where there's a lot of glare and a lot of bright light, you know, these would be a perfect set of glasses if you took a trying to you know focus on an object or you're trying to you know, scan the horizon uh, for any reason these are going to be a great solution for you really really high quality uh, again you know all of the lenses are the same shapes so they really do cover a lot of the eye and around the eye gives you great peripheral vision um, and nothing really hinders that and again they sit very very close to the face um, to give you as maximum protection for your eyes as possible got a few you know little logos and stuff on here so ball tactical and you've got some information about the ballistic protection from the glasses so Really, really solid little package. Obviously, it all comes in this nice bowl box. I'm just wrapping all this up. You can see in there the glasses um, and the th and the two lenses below. Really, really impressed with these. Um, wearing them over a weekend, giving them a bit of a stress test. So I shot at them, um, took them out on the run. I was doing some shooting with them all day. Had no problems with them at all. No steaming up, no misting up. And these are going to be my dedicated go-to glasses now. Really, really happy with um, the product so far from Bowl. I am going to review the rest of the glasses individually. Um, if you do have any questions about these products um, or you want to know where to get them, head over to UK Tactical. They've got a full range of Bowl glasses over there. Uh, if you do have any questions about these or the other glasses that I've got here, please feel free to drop a comment in the box below. I hope that's enough information for you. Um, I'm very, very impressed with them. I've got to say from the off, just the quality of the product in its entirety and just the stress test that I've put it through so far um, has been absolutely outstanding and these are going to be my go-to glasses so thank you very much for watching thanks to Bold Tactical for sending me out the glasses I'll be happy to carry on reviewing uh, the rest of the solutions and the rest of the glasses and hopefully we can get some really great results uh, from the rest of them so thank you very much for watching I hope you've enjoyed the video and I will see you all soon